Hey what's up guys, I'm Ken Bonanno and welcome back to my channel. Today we're back with more God of War Ragnarok. So in the last video we were thrown into the chaos of Thimble Winter. We discovered Fenrir, the wolf, died. Atreus went off to bury him and he transformed into a bear, which I called, may I say. After that, we got home, we had a little visit from Thor and Odin. They came in with a peace offering and we were just not gonna, you know, kill each other or get in each other's way. And in return, they would make sure that Freya would not come after us. And we kindly declined. And for doing so, we were attacked by Thor and his hammer. We just finished the fight. No one died. And now we're with Brock and Sindri, and I think we're gonna make our way back to the house because Atreus is there with Odin, which is not good. So let's get started. Okay, here we are. Are they wearing little Christmas hats? <laughs> that would be cute. We must check on Atreus. Need to keep warm. Well, good to see you making new friends. Ain't that me all near pack a punch? You know we made that hammer, right? You, you did. It. Oh yeah, they did. That. Wasn't ever sure you were listening. <laughs> At least it was good to see the axe hold her own. Yeah. Kind of the point after all. And that we actually just stood a chance. With no upgrades. We have nothing. We're back in Oh, look at that frozen lightning, it's still there. That was so fucking cool. This will get you home. Oh, wait. Sorry. The door. Shall we see how fast it is? Has it changed? Hey, one last thing there, Tiny. If you got Aesir at your door, then I reckon your protection staves busted. Once you chase Odin off, you got another place to lay your head tonight? And I don't mean that talking. We will not abandon my home. Oh yeah? And what's to stop the all fucker from spying on you? Or raven pecking your house to splinters while you're asleep in it? Nothing, that's what. You go get your boy, and I'll speak to a certain someone about putting you up at his place in a pinch. Alright. Thanks, Brock. Oh boy, please be here. Everything seems to be normal. I guess my mirror is going to be gone too. Brother! Oh, thank lord. I was about to look for you. Are you? What does he want? <sighs> to uh, pay for the roof. And he invited me to Asgard. Did he? I couldn't hear once he went outside. I, I told him no, obviously. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be a bit suspicious about that. For oh, so he didn't know. If I told you I was looking for him, you would have said not to. So you hid the truth from me. I wanted to tell you. I really did, but now that you know, there's something you should see. No. Just trust me, you'll want to. Trust! You have broken my trust. Then let me regain it. Let me show you what I found. Besides, we haven't seen the last of Odin or Thor. And clearly they can just walk in and blast holes in our home whenever they want. There's only one way to get them off our backs. And I think I know how. Sir.
Take him. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. What is the shiny things yeah, on the yeah, table? Oh, uh, wait, it's for the doors. The... <laughs> that... I don't think I remember. Well, it's nice we still have those. Whoa. Gear up. Armor, equipment, improved stats like defense to help Kratos survive and strength to do more damage. Equip gear before heading out. Okay. Oh, they changed this. Okay. Um, Select a new armor piece, then press X to equip it. Oh, this one looks cool. I'm gonna take this one because it looks the best <laughs> okay armor that allows the wearer additional movement around the joints its construction allows the user to swing their weapon with more force increasing their strength yeah we'll take this um let me go back wrist armor okay they changed it a little bit I can change the knob. The Führer's Mall. It gives a bit more strength. Okay. Okay. I uh, might wanna. Can I change these? Nope. Oh, no. Uh, God damn it. It was too quick. Are you ready? Go. Can we change on the go? Oh, and keep the change, you bastard! <laughs> We don't want your money. Uh. Oh, so I can. Oh. Follow Atreus into the forest. Wait, can I go back in? Okay, we're gonna read the codex in a bit. Now we can change. Oh, you're here. <laughs> okay. Change between the weapons. Hmm. Maybe we just can't change our gear on the go just yet, but. Where are we going? The old temple in the Wildwoods. Why? It'll be easier to explain once we're there. Lower Wildwoods. Zo didn't say anything else while you were outside. Yeah. He said he doesn't care about Jotunheim anymore, that the giants can keep their secrets. He's averted Ragnarok his own way. Do you think he knows all the giants are dead? I'm more concerned that it no longer matters to him. What's he up to? Yeah. Whoa, boy. What did you do? Oh! What happened here? Nice. So close to home. The raiders warring oh. with one another now. Those are not their arrows. Something else is out here. Oh, great. Can I retake that? Oh, God. Oh, God. I did not see them. I just saw this guy. Holy shit. More over here. And fresh. Is it Freya? Get in while the state was down. That or Odin Whoa. cocked up the protection spell altogether. What oh, do you see? Good God. Just animal tracks. Could it not be Freya then, or can she only transform into a raven? Not a raven. Um, the falcon. Sorry. Foes. There we go. Thor. There are many differences between Thor and his brother Baldur. Baldur fought wildly, his motivation to conflict pain. Thor is calmer. His bloodlust is for the fight itself and not for the suffering it inflicts. 
The full force of his attack is as heavy as any I have felt. The hammer Mjölner, <laughs> I'm going to call it that because that's how we say it in Danish, only compo compounds his power. Each blow echoes with the death and destruction they have wrought, wrought, wrought together. He chose to end our fight prematurely. It is good for the both of us that it did not reach its conclusion. Oh, there's a lot here. Jesus. Okay. Like his son before him, Odin has come to our door. He does not seek vengeance for Baldur, but instead he speaks of peace and in action. Odin claims that Atreus has been searching for Tyr and has requested he hold this en endeavor. I am not pleased that he knows more about what my son is doing than I. While I do not approve of what Atreus has done behind my back, I will not abide the gods of this realm coming to my home and dictating our actions. If he does not want us searching for Tyr, it is likely that is exactly what we should be doing. I must note that he offered a deal of peace for our inaction. If I did not have better counsel, I would have been tempted to take it. His threat to Freya made this impossible. She may persist as a danger, but to ally against her with her former husband is unacceptable. That shows a lot of character. Char uh, blah, blah, blah. That shows a lot of character, Kratos. I like that. Okay. Raider. Few who so these are the enemies that have attacked us so far. Few humans are left in the wildwoods these days. Those who survive have either stashed themselves away in the warmest places they can find, or should they choose not to hide, have only fended off the cold by transmogrifying their filgia, their guardian spirit. This part of their soul takes the traits of an animal, allowing them to adapt to Midgar's unforgiving climate. As of late, the various remaining raiders around the wildwood, wildwoods seem to help it on murdering the lot of us. The protection staff keeps interloopers at bay, but every hunting trip beyond its border borders inevitably results in encountering a scouting party or two. Raider Scout. Ramos raiders favor the strength and pride of the stack for their filga. Scouts favor the owl for its sharp eyes and sharper talons. They often claim to be able to peer through the eyes of Midgard's owls, but this strikes me as a boastful havers. They favor ranged attack and are deadly accurate with their slings. Okay. Hey, come burn this bramble off. It'll be quicker. Yes. Uh, Almost to the bridge. I missed it. Oh, I missed the blades. I the bridge gave out. Gonna need another path to the temple. Why I see it. Come out this way alone, lad. I had dreams calling me here. Wait. Dreams. Okay. Definitely Whoa. seeing some new things. That one's still alive. No. Look closer. Ah, hell Raiders now? Who's doing this? Suppose it's too much to hope that an enemy of theirs would be a friend of ours. Yeah. Probably. Can we do something? Oh! Warn me. Oh. oh. Some enemies resist the Leviathan Axe. Like that? Hell Raider? Your standard stack style raider, only dead and far more dangerous for it. Relentless, frenzied, rageful creatures. Lighting them on fire should help calm them down. <laughs> okay. So what did you do to relax today? Oh, I just let myself on you fire. something down there? Maybe. <gasps> that is so much faster. I love it. Hack solver. Okay, I guess that was it. Oh, yes. I really love that we don't have to climb. Because it's quite slow in this game. Like, obviously we might have to later on. For some sections, but not for all of them. Oh. Come to it. Whoa! What the hell, brother? What was that? 
Something strong and dangerous. Be on guard. <laughs> oh yeah, being all the way on guard. Something strong and dangerous. Oh. Oh wait. Okay. There's the temple now. Just need to find a way around. Okay, I'm guessing we're gonna go that way then. Oh, wait. I'll take it. Okay, let me just look this way. I'm scared to progress when I don't want to Whatever progress. It, is, it works fast. There we go. Some more hack silver. Right, but where did it go? I'm guessing it's not Freya then. Okay. Alrighty. I need to remember that we can use Atreus. But remember when I said there was someone who might help us get answers about the giants and Loki? You mean Tyr, the old god of war in these lands, who is dead. Well, for a dead man, Odin seemed pretty keen on seeing he wasn't found, right? Oh. He knows Tyr could unite the realms against him. Plus, Tyr was the giant's greatest ally. So Enough. <laughs> Didn't even think we could go down there. Okay. Oh, so every time he does that, we can. That's cool. I love that we don't have to climb. That is such... So good. I don't get the beetles, though. They're a bit weird. There's probably a reason that they're here. Okay, let me just check. Okay, can't go down there. So, I'm guessing we'll have to scooch in over here. Oh! Look out! Oh, Right, the pee pee. Oh, wait, hello. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, that's awesome. So I wanted to see if you could do the same thing for the blades that you could... Skill tree available. Oh, cool. So yeah, I wanted to see if you could do the same thing for the blades as you could with the, the Leviathan Axe, where you hold triangle to kind of load the weapon. And you can! Unlock skills with XP to gain access to new moves and abilities. Kratos and Atreus earn XP separately in combat and have their own unique skill trees. Uh -huh. Watchful Protector. Atreus watches for moments to follow up on Kratos' attack, extending his combo. Atreus can assist with Kratos' combo, matching hit for hit. Ah, I like that. So do we have that already? I guess so. Okay. Okay, and then we have different things here. Yeah. Press R1 during flame whiplash. Uh, slash enemies and apply moderate burn. 
If flame rip blast, you fully charge, create a wave fire on the ground. That's so cool. Oh, it's a square if I can purchase it. Okay. Blades melee attacks against frosted enemies deal bonus damage. That could be good. After impaling an enemy with Hyperion pull, hold R1 to launch forward. After impelling an enemy with blazing search, hold R2 to throw the other blade to the target. This one could be good. Hold R1 to unleash a high damage flurry of attacks on a single enemy with uh, the blades in hand. Knock off the rust. Okay. Maybe we see if we have something for the axe. Melee attacks against burning enemies deal bonus damage. Aim and hold to charge, causing to spin. <gasps> I love that one. I want to get it. There we go. And for Atreus, we could not get anything yet. All right. Shield. All right. Spartan Rage. Oh, wait. Oh, I can upgrade that as well. Oh. Okay, that's cool. Get some rage. So yeah, I'm just trying to get like the hang of things again. What uh, is this? That pillar wasn't in the way last time I came. Okay. Oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> and then I can pull it. Can I pull it back? Okay. That's normal. <laughs> That's cool. I like it. Like I was saying, Tyr was an ally to the giants. So he'd be on our side if we find him. And if anyone might know who I'm supposed to be, it's him. If he's out there, we gotta find him. How can we not? Those are many ifs, Atreus. No. We'll see soon. So... Oh, that's very clever. That's our way back. Boy, we're not going that way. I'm sorry. I don't think we are, at least. Whee! I'm loving it. Wait. Alright. Well, maybe we are going that way. <laughs> Hold on a minute. Okay. We might be. Oh yeah, this is not where we were. I can't recognize places anymore. It's fine. Uh, oh, I see. Okay, then we do. I can't imagine what the lads found, but he says he has evidence. We've come this far. Let's see it. Yeah, I mean, what can it hurt? Famous last words. Many dead here. We should keep moving. We're getting in trouble. A mesh triangle to charge up the blades of chaos with fire. Too late. Oh shit, wait. Yes, I'm trying to. Oh, wait, okay. Yes! 
Fuck yeah. <laughs> this is so fucking cool. Oh wait, hold on. Okay. Don't kick my ass. So good. Oh shit. Oh my god. Um, okay, excuse me. That is not good. Um. Okay. Jesus Christ. I love it already. I love it so much. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, this way. There we go. Some toasty branches. Isn't it nice how Fimble Winter wore down all the helpful magic we acquired? Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. As if on cue. Let's go. That's so good. I love that move. Kill. So good. Winterman. Yep. God, I wonder who they mean. He can read now. Good on you, Kratos. Oh my god. Oh, I can go down here. Oh, wait. Let's go. I really love the combat so far again. I'm just falling in love with it all over. <sighs> okay. Are we climbing? Climb. On. <laughs> Thank you for... Ah, he has gotten rather good at that. For that, Kratos. I like how I ask and he answers. Yet another grizzly scene. Oh god. There we go. Yeah. You know, we're just learning what's best, what works good. Let's just keep that there. We climb. I've seen my share of bloodshed. But this is an awful lot. A smiley! <gasps> oh, Jesus Christ! Who the hell are you? Oh, it's a horse. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the? the huntress. A stalker! On your guard, brother! It's a stalker! Oh my dear god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh shit. You feel busted, brother. 
Just keep your feet moving, yeah? She is broken. Excuse me? Let's go. The raiders throw an Odin barging in, and now stalkers playing in our woods. This is Holy not shit. even anymore. Oh my god. Light runic attack. Form a mass of eyes around a Leviathan axe and run up to strike a target. Okay. There we go. While blocking, press R1 to use a light runic attack. Okay. A shield. Okay. So we can't do anything. Alright. That's how it works. The shield mom gave you. Thor damaged it, but now... Perhaps the dwarves could take uh. a look at it. Perhaps. Later. Come on, a Captain America shield. Way. Oh, wait. I'm checking everything. New lore. The Ashen God. It is the Ashen God's fault. She told us the witch said the Ashen God murdered Baldur and in so doing started Fimble Winter. She said, if the god dies, Fimble Winter will end. No more night, no more cold, no Ragnarok. We ran out of food a week ago. No matter. Soon we will feast on god flesh. If the god dies. Now which god is that? Oh. Why are we here, Atreus? Okay. You remember all those shrines we found? Telling the stories of giants, how the panel on the left would be their origin and the panel on the right would be their fate? Yes, we found many. I have seen them. Well, we can there's more to them than we realized. Okay, pointless, I guess. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, we find all those shrines. The last game. Well, the collapsed pillar is new, but the shrine is just on the other side. Wait. Ah, things collapsing on a regular basis in these parts. Fimble Winter wears down all things, even stone. Whee! Okay, let's move this. <laughs> Oh, again. Boom. Can I not do that? Okay, wait. There we go. That should help. That took me a few seconds to realize. Over on the right. There we go. Come on. Oh. Is this the- I think this is, might be the first shrine you can find. Yeah, so this is about Ragnarok. How it starts with the sun and the moon. You watching? Oh! 
There's a door. Well, I think. that's new. <laughs> Interesting. Come on. Atreus. Kratos like. Yeah, I don't think he's waiting. What the fuck, boy? <laughs> oh, I've missed Mimir. He's so funny. I missed all of them. Oh, what is this, lad? Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories, the secret stories, those they kept here, inside. You remember the story of Skull and Hati? Mm -hmm. The wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, this shows the giant setting Skull and Hati free. They're free? Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. <laughs> See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanaheim. Not the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are, chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Oh. Somehow. Atreus. See? Hati's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. <laughs> Not totally Maybe. sure who this is, but someone comes along and rescues the moon. And then the moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse. I haven't seen one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do? We're coming to that. Look, here's Ragnarok. Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Right? Mimir. True. Can this be? Odin told me he killed Tyr, and he trusted me at the time, or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? What if he's just had him locked up somewhere all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait. We are going home. Wait. I have one more oh, thing wait. to show you. It's just out here. Oh, it's so pretty. Looks like the PlayStation uh, boot up screen a little bit with the particles. <laughs> wait, we're going out? What is this? Everything I found. Well, almost everything. That's the thing he was looking at in the beginning? That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jotunheim again? No, I found it in one of the other shrines. Other mm -hmm. shrines? How many have you visited? <laughs> I, well, all of them? All the ones I could still get to in Midgard, anyway. I don't know what it is. But it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned. But I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. He mentioned black smoke and the bleeding earth. But... We can never figure out exactly. We. Yeah. Uh oh. Sindri's been helping me. Oh. <laughs> Look, I talked him into it. It it wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Black smoke. Bleeding earth. I was gonna say Muspelheim, but I don't think that's gonna be. Muspelheim. Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the bleeding out? Sounds like a mine eye. Uh, hmm. The realm of the dwarves, perhaps. Svartalfheim, that's a good bet. Their mines did belch black smoke, and Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. That's it then. Tears in Svartalfheim somewhere, imprisoned in a mine? So? What now? Home. 
I like how me and Kratos thinks think alike. Like <laughs> I say something and then he's he says something. Lad, even if we consider looking for Tia, how do you have us get into Svartalfine? You know Odin's had all travel between realms locked up tight. Sindri said he had an idea or two about that. Sindri is full of ideas. Well you know the thro the dwarves. They're creative. They're good craftsmen. Ground looks kind of cracked there. Can I go up here? Wait. That might be where we're going. Hold on. Oh, no, wait. Get a little bit nervous about progressing. <laughs> uh, okay. We might have to jump down. I do not know. Where does this go? Back? Where are we? Oh, secrets. Awesome. I'm good at finding those today. What's going on? Guess it's because I'm actually looking around for for once. Well, there's something down there as well. Hold on, boy. Remember when we fought our first troll out this way? I remember you oh, it's lost under. the troll. We must tread carefully, brother. Danger is close. You okay fighting without a shield? It is not my first time. Oh, maybe this. What's under there? Ah, back to smashing two things for fun and profit. Lovely. <laughs> we love doing that. Mimir. So that's how we got here. Okay. To the lad? Not much. They stepped outside. But he told us about it. I wouldn't worry. What about the things he did not tell us? <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I mean, I don't think we can trust, you know, Odin or Thor. I guess they have kind of already showed that. Um, but I'm kind of interested what Odin wants with Loki. Atreus, I mean. Oh, can we please? Yes, this has something to do with Ragnarok. It's not gonna go well. <laughs> Behind you! Incoming! Come on then. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's broken. Keep forgetting. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh god. Let's go. So brutal. Uh, I love how they put in new finishers. So fun. It's just like a guessing game every time you meet a new enemy. Like, what is Kratos gonna do? Brother, a word. Don't hold the lad's curiosity against him. It goes with being young. In my youth, we learned obedience. And is that what you wish for him? Brother, he's going to walk his own path. If you don't want him walking away from you, then smarten up and walk with him a while. Hmm. That's some wise words. If we could find a way to open rum travel to Spartacon, I 
Bet there'd be all sorts of useful equipment for us to Enough. We will go. Really? But if we do not find Tyr, you will abandon your search. For good. All right. You won't be sorry. I'm kind of interested to see if they're going to have something like Valkyries in this game. Like something, you know, to do after you finish the main game. Uh, because I, as repetitive as they might have been, I really enjoyed it. I think they were a lot of fun to do, so. But yeah. And it, I feel, feel like it could be fun to do, once we finish the game here on the channel, like do some platinum streams where we get the platinum trophy. Um, but yeah, we'll have to see what they are. I haven't even looked at them. I don't know if I can. Oh, <gasps> Sentry! Over here! Hey, my dude. Sentry! As I live and breathe, is that Atreus? <laughs> it's been so long. Oh, he's lying. How you grown? Uh, oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, if you'll follow me, Brock mentioned he needed somewhere safe to spend the night, and I believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that. We're still your favorite dwarves, right? Nope. You're still the only dwarves we know. <laughs> I'll take it. It's good to see them as well. After you, my friends. Alright, hey. We, we survived Fimple Winter. The cleanest cabin in all the nine realms. Oh. And I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. <sighs> After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Till you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. This is so pretty. We're gonna have to jump off the edge again. You mm. do remember we don't have the Unity Stone to let us jump off, right? Of course he remembers. Right, mm -hmm. brother? Of course I remember. Of course. <laughs> As you can see, We've settled here in the realm between realms. Whoa. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimba Winter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're in the house. Oh, that's that's cool. amazing, Sin. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. Intriguing. I can't look around. I want to. <laughs> wow. So pretty. I like Work how they. Way, yes, yes, yes. Like if this is like a permanent place you can go to, I like how they have kind of utilized this loading, what just used to be a loading screen. Um, I like how they utilized it more. It's so pretty. Oh my Does god. Come in. <laughs> Come in. Now. If you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. Yeah, he's a little bit germaphobe. You're not going to wipe your feet, are you? Okay, then. Your bedrooms are there. The kitchen is just over there. Any... Anybody need a snack? <laughs> Kratos? <laughs> snack? I do not need a snack. He's hangry. What we need is your help getting to Svardo Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Al alive? I mean, that's... What? It it's okay. I told him everything. Everything? You waited my son and disobeyed me. No, I I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important <laughs> right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just... It's just... There's... It's just a lot of mud. And why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was... Something we needed your help with. Oh... The Holder brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey! Oh, Jesus Christ. Not so fast. How'd that get in here? <laughs> when the hell is he anyway? That is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? <laughs> He's too damn tall now. And he looks like... That. 
I blame you. <laughs> well, come on then, let's get him something that fits He's just getting older, you dark flat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Oh my god. <laughs> what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. <laughs> oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallivanting. I love them so much. You know this. Mmm. Busted up good. <laughs> Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? I love them so much. That was hilarious. <laughs> Poor Trace, <Trace>, though. <laughs> Craft and upgrade armor, weapon attachments, and items using collected resources. Brock has enough materials to forge a new shield. I only okay. got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do. Hmm. Oh, a shield fit for high risk and high reward parries. I guess there's going to be something with the like the timing that might be a like a, a smaller parry window. Oh my god, a shield fit for absorbing attacks and striking back. Oh, I see. So this is a parry shield and the other one is a bit more of a you know, I'm gonna take hits. I like parrying. So I think we're gonna go with this and then we'll see how it goes. A shield crafted for a warrior focused on their foe's intentions, not for the faint of heart. That is cool. Kratos' ability to, to block is restored. Now it's time to get Atreus some new armor. Okay. Brock will craft some custom armor to fit Atreus companion armor. If the kid's gonna insist on getting taller, best make a habit of swinging in for new duds. Duds. Craftable equipment is indicated with a hammer icon in the list. Oh, cool. Look at the armor crafted with care by the legendary Holdra brothers, said to be one of their finest works. Okay, we can craft some new waist armor. Uh, defense. Hmm. I like a bit more balanced, so. Equip it. I can also upgrade it. Um, there we go. Twelve. I'm gonna upgrade this one. Or oh, wait, can I do something to our weapons? I would like to see that first. <clears throat> Looks like Thimble Winner's been hard on our girl. Give her here. She's overdue for some Brock love. <laughs> some Brock love. <laughs> Uh, okay, no, we can't. We need a chaos flame. Okay. Uh, I can still upgrade this, so let's do that. Spit shine. <laughs> Armor that allows. Yes, okay. Found I think we're pretty good for now. Behind. Tossed him in the chest. What would you do without me? I'm gonna go look oh. around. Check out my room. Tell Sindri when you're ready. 
Oh, that's cool. I knew we'd left something behind. Oh. Ah. Awesome. I love that. That is also new. Um, see if we have some things we can get here. Press R2 during Frost Awakening to slash upwards. That could be good. If our melee attacks a quick, quick succession without sustaining damage to power up to five things and inflict frost damage on every hit. That I would like to get. Um... get that and just get that uh this one sure let's get this might as well all right and how's life been treating everyone's favorite as your vulgarian the fuck you call me <laughs> <laughs> exquisite <laughs> Oh my god. I love Brock. I think we got like a new, some new lore. Oh, wait, sorry. How do I? Oh, it's Codex. There we go. The dwarven blacksmith Brock was the first ally we encountered when we set out for the mountain's peak. He and his brother Sindri made the Leviathan Axe for F F Fae, and this has been our common bond. Brock is blunt with a foul tongue. But there is a wisdom in his bluster. I find him acceptable company. Uh, the Huntress. The stalker that ambushed us has broken my shield. She was a formidable <laughs> Huntress I fought well. I must alter my defensive strategy now that I do not have the ability to block. At least now we will be mentally prepared if we encounter another stalker. Winterman. Kill Winterman. The runes appear to be the work of raiders, but I do not know the Winterman. Their attacks have increased of late. Perhaps he is the source of their agitation. Stalker Huntresses are worshippers of um, Sky. I don't know. A legendary giant giantess renowned for her hun hunting expertise. They're usually a peaceful group wanting nothing more than to find their next challenge. It appears recent times have made some of them far more aggressive and ruthless. It can't be said if it's completely Fimple Winter's fault, as with much of the pain in the in these realms, I suspect Odin's tampering with the natural order has something to do with it. Um Wait! Those oh. stairs will not support you. Please don't break my house. What? <laughs> Oh, those stairs. Oh, well, I was not going to. <laughs> See? I knew you wanted a snack. <laughs> I went to the... Oh, is that cheese? Looks like cheese. Do you like cheese, Kratos? Is he a cheese man? What do you guys reckon? No, oh, what's this? Nothing, I guess. Hey, come see. Hello? I guess this is where they store the food. Nice to have options if I wake up hungry. Uh huh. You found the perfect room. Now, what the hell is that? Awesome. Big, big food. Okay. Okay, I know we need to go and talk to Sindri, but. I am curious. Ooh. That's beautiful. The architecture. Everything all right, I hope. Yes, it is very, very pretty. How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me and be sure to bring the head. <laughs> <laughs> he has a name, you so, know. Where exactly is Tyr being held? He is imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. 
Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader who knew mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I what think is that? The ta da! <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. I didn't, Sidri. I'll have up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel I'm just not sure what it is. Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? <laughs> and you, you just remember things however they pop into your being, don't you? I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. What do you mean, Brock? Will he help us or not? No, oh, never mind. It ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. This smudge sponger notwithstanding. Ignoring you. Fine. <laughs> Go darken Derlin's door. See for yourself how it goes. Just be warned, he's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. He's cranky as all get out. And he talk funny, too. Sounds like a true study in contrast. <laughs> I've always wanted to see your home realm. Svartalfheim sounds unique. Svartalfheim? <laughs> Stupid Aesir name. We look like dark elves to you. Oh, right. You call the realm something else. Nidavellir, which is also the name of the capital city and where you should look for Durlin. Damn city so full of Odin fuckers nowadays. <laughs> it ain't hardly somewhere a self-respecting dwarf would show his face. Harsh, but accurate. <laughs> Odin fuckers. <laughs> oh my god, why is that so funny? Okay. <laughs> you hear that? Uh, maybe? It's like a squirrel. Are those some kind of dragons? They're so far, I can't tell how big they are. Oh my god. I hope not. Eh? No, it looks more like the... Do you guys... If you played the first game, do you remember those things that would pop out of the ground? Looks more like those. We'll just oh yes, yeah, the travel the travel stone, the blue thing. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help oh. you get a better look at the problem with those bifrost eyes of yours. So I. Uh, do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your <laughs> eyes. Oh, oh, Cindy, a stodding bastard! <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Mimir. Open. Open now. I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh! That's it. That's it. Good. Now, release. Still unpleasant. Oh, that's our cue. Come on, hurry. I'm coming. I'm coming. Release. Crossfall of eggs, man. What was that for? <laughs> You'll see soon enough. <laughs> Just there. That should do it. Whoa. See, no permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck. Kratos, throw me at him. Horns first! Kids, <laughs> <laughs> it takes a joke, you old goat! <laughs> oh my god. The Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. Oh, cool. I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first, come on, let me show you how it works. Do I need to do something? 
Oh. Okay. Aim your key at the room for Svartalfheim on the right. Then concentrate. Ooh. Press X while hovering over the wetlands. Oh. Wait. Oh, it is here? Okay. This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir City. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And the grim are everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck! <laughs> Oh. Whoa. Request for tear. Feel that? What's that, lad? Anything, everything. It's warm. <sighs> the music. <gasps> oh, wait. <gasps> Is this our first bird? Oh, so close. I can just go closer, but... One less feathery spy. Let's go! There's 48. That can't have been the first one. We can probably use this boat. If I can just get it... Oh, sorry. Okay. Do I do something? Oh. Careful, lad. Sorry, Atreus. Oh, whoa. What the hell? Ooh. Why are these things so fast? Excuse me? Do I just block them when they jump me? Oh my god, why? What the hell? Oh god. Hello? You're acting a bit weird. Hello? <laughs> oh my god. There we go. Is there more? He would already off to a lively stop. Atreus, <laughs> you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. We can head through these channels when you're ready. All right. Uh, let's have a little bit of a look around. Oh, my God. They really, really know how to make these. What's the chain in the water for? That'd be a dwarven supply ferry. Oh. Said fairy appears to be missing. Huh. Good God, they really know how to make the environments, don't they? Good Lord, this is incredible. I'm in love. I don't know if there is anything else than that. Hmm. Boys. Ba -ba 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 boat. I still Boys. can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might oh, boys. Have that Let's go! <laughs> what it did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. There are resources. Ooh. Oh, yes. The shiny. There's gold. If you never asked mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, woman, 
Guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. <laughs> and then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than Can I, I go in? No? Wait. Over here then. Okay. So Kratos a no fisherman. Look at them! Whoops, okay, sorry. That's the only one I'll kill, I promise. It was for science, I promise. Nothing else. Okay, I think we're just going around, but I want my hack silver. Here we go. Okay, so the sandy uh, beach is where we can go or put the boat. Uh, did you see that over there? No. What was it? I'm nervous. <laughs> Ain't nothing's gonna push me in the water, okay? There we go. That wheel is blocking the channel. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able mm -hmm. to get through. So these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know what is a fair bit more potent <gasps> than when I last visited, now that you mention it. How do Looks I get like it? The path continues on the other side of that geyser. Well, I don't think we can just jump through it, can we now? <laughs> if only we were in Midgard. That water'd be frozen in the second. Uh. Oh. Good clue, Atreus. Thank you. <laughs> Is this our first one? Exciting! And last one is... Somewhere over the rainbow... Huh. Oh! There's froggies. I fucking hate frogs. I'm so scared of them. <laughs> uh, you guys see it. I sure as hell don't. Maybe if we go up top. Oh, oh what's this? Looks to be an artifact from the Dwarven Resistance. Raid Mars Brassard, father of a few dwarves you may be well familiar with. Bro artifact, sorry for cutting him off. Reitma is known for two things. Firstly, he was one of the great armorers of Swartolheim. Swartolheim. Secondly, his sons are all dragons. That's right, Reitma fathered the dragons you know you now know as Rigin, Fafnir, and Oter. Wasn't a terribly good father by any measure, unless you directly rate one's per paternal ability to the amount of fire their sons can breathe anyway. <laughs> but damn but damn if he couldn't make a good set of plate mail. Odin wanted him to design the Einherjord's armor. Heidma Obli. By oblige, uh, by oblige, sorry, <laughs> by oblige, of course, I mean built a fatal flaw into the armor that would cause the breastplate to snap like stale, stale bread from the slightest blow. About a dozen Einhjord died before the Allfather realized what had happened. They caught Heidma trying to escape through a realm travel gate. You can imagine what happened next. 
may be interested in getting these back. Better in his hands than out in the open. There we go. Our first little puzzle chest. Whee. Exciting. <gasps> and it's the apple. Idrun apple. Collect enough and we get a maximum health increased. Let's go. Think that's dirty enough to climb? Aye. Good old dwarven craftsmanship. It has to be. Tyr was a friend to the giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The god of war often advocated for the giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. There's got to be a faster way to get down there. Well. Oh, there's like a little village up there. Do you guys think that's where we're going? Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Oh, oh my god. Ah! Oh god. Oh my god. Okay, missing everything up, missing everything up. Okay. I have not seen these before. Okay, it's not going well. Oh god. Cut him in half. Dauntless shields. I'm trying. Oh my god. On your left. We do this for health. Bye-bye. Oh my god. Come on, get up, brother. Trying to parry, it's not easy, okay? Oh, you know. Oh, 
Oh, both of them. Let's go. One more to go. Up with his head. Holy shit. Okay, that went better. But I definitely still need... Oh. Oh, we're climbing that. Okay. I definitely still need to... Find a rhythm of everything. Oh no, that goes up there. don't hear the bird and by bird I mean like ravens okay there's got to be some way to turn the wheel up here let's have a look oh, oh Jesus oh, Christ if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek the ground was that an earthquake hmm an occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartalfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Think you can reach the wheel from here? Absolutely. Oh wow. Nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. <laughs> I was thinking, because it's so warm, Maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Spartalfarm? I lie. Fimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Fimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Mm. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Hmm. Think we can fit under that bridge? Limbo, limbo, limbo. <laughs> That's fun. Oh. That looks interesting. A drink from the dev of the world tree brings lasting benefits to the runic attacks, I think it said. Oh, there's two beaches. Okay. We have this here. Oh god. Let's go. Here we go. Kaboosh. So satisfying doing that. I love it. Oh, what the hell happened to you? Oh. I see. <laughs> it's a bit suspicious that we can get health here. Father, up there. Oh, you smart, smart boy. What does that do? Oh. 
<gasps> oh. Ah. <sighs> there is so much to this. I did not expect. Oh, wait. Is this the way down? Find Might be. Good up there? Yeah, I'm not done. Uh, what else? Oh. Some hack silver. All right. Then we can go down. Um, right. So these do not connect. Okay, so we need to go on the other side. <sighs> I don't know if it's just me, but I really just love um, exploring like these areas. I think it's so much fun. Oh god. Kind of like how if you mess up the parry, which I do a lot apparently, <laughs> uh, you can have Atreus just stun them or interrupt them with his arrows, which is quite nice. Oh god. Goodbye. Oh, hello. There we are. Those things are everywhere. Yep. That's stressful. Uh Okay. So they have those guys. Oh. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. Oh, that wheel. Uh. Hmm. Okay, we froze one of those guys. Is there another one somewhere? Yeah, then that one gets taller. Okay, I see. Hold on. There we go. The wheel's moving and the gate's coming down. That's more of an ingenuity for you. Back to the boat. Back to the boat, boy. If the dwarves of this realm are anything like Rock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. Could I have went over there? I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. Yeah. We take war seriously as gods. Apparently. Well, I don't know. I'm kind of just speechless. I remember playing the first game. Um, I didn't. Atreus, you intend to recruit Tyr as an ally for war. I just. 
I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Me too. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warm. So yeah, I didn't play the first game for the first time on my channel. I just replayed it on my channel. Um, Looks like we got to find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nidavolir. Yeah, I just remember, you know, playing this game, just getting lost in it. Oh god, that does not look good. Oh, that was far away. It's too fast. Suspicious. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. Hmm. But why do we need to catch it? Is it a collectible? Okay, hold on. <laughs> you did it. Let's see what it draw. Oh, so I guess they drop like special things. They drop a lot of stuff. Holy shit. Oh, they're worth the trouble. I see. Interesting. That is also new. Halfway there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Yeah, we'll find it. No worries. All right. Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. Yes, yes. I'm just looking, boy. Let me We're pushing the car. There's stuff here. I can't pick it up. Great. Oh. Oh, wait. <laughs> Where's he stuck? In Is he new? Jesus. Pizza! Oh, whoa, that was a new move. Oh, ew. Is there another one? Nice. Can I get this now? Thank you, Hack Silver. All right, now we can pull this off. Think you can uncover that geyser from here? Yes, that's what I'm trying to do. And then I do this. Yay! Oh, Hustle solvers. I think I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. You only realized that now? Um. Right. Oh, we need to cut that. Okay, I see. Nice one. There we go. Thank you, my boy. Can you see anything from that block? Wait. What am I doing? Block is coming down. Uh... Oh, wait, okay. I got it. <laughs> something else we can hit? What about freezing the guys? Yes, that's what I just. Oh, God. That's clever. I like it. That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. 
Ah, a story of relentless genius from the mind of Kvasir. Imagine, dear reader, if you so dare, creatures of metal that screech through the air, that swim through the seas, that bound across the land, but are brought to their knees by a warrior's hand. Her origins hidden, her hair red as blood, finding places forbidden, buried under the mud. But who is this young girl, who is more than she seemeth? Who will rescue her people and slay the be these behemoths? I like that. That was cool. Alright, pull the chain. Lad, if I may, what exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. <laughs> we have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. No. We're just in a wild goose hunt. But I mean, we already know. You think there will be another if we've seen the trainers. It's unlikely, but geological disturbances if he's alive or not. Predictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye, you might be onto something, lad. Or do we get to see the... Atreus, look ahead. Jokmundur? Is that what they call him? Wow. Now this looks like Lugos a city. Welcome to neither the wheel, brothers. Oh my god, this is gorgeous. Holy shit. Hey, dwarves! Hello. Oh. They're, uh, running away. Oh, are they scared? Oh. I love this. An alarm. Chickens! I send an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Wild they just spit in the water. They are scared. They are terrified. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Oh, God. This can't be good. See a chest over there. Alright guys, I think this video is long enough. We got to explore a little bit and play a lot more today or than in the previous video because a lot of the intro is just cutscenes, getting the player set up for the story and what is going to happen. Uh, so it's very nice getting a bit more of a feel for the combat and the exploration and the new puzzles that they have kind of put in for us. Uh, so yeah, I had a lot of fun and I am absolutely having the time of my life playing this game right now and I hope you guys are enjoying these videos. So next video we're gonna try and find Durlin. He must be here around somewhere and yeah hopefully he can point us in the direction of Tyr. We're just getting started on this amazing journey and I'm just starving to play more. I, I just it, it tickles in my hands and I just want to continue but I also just want to take my time and be as thorough as I possibly can. I'm obviously gonna miss a few things here and there but I am just know that I'm doing my absolutely best to try and find everything and yeah it's gonna take me a little while to get used to the combat and like all the the skills how we use them because we can change them and then I need to remember like what we just changed it to what the new uh, command is for it so yeah it's gonna take me a little while but I'll get the hang of it eventually Thank you guys so much for all the love and support for this series. Just know that you guys watching, it means a lot to me. And, and I'm so incredibly grateful if you're going to stick around for my playthrough. It really, really means a lot. And yeah, I'm sorry for not talking a lot, but sometimes I'm just, you know, taking in the moment and just, you know, looking around, just 
appreciating actually being able to play this game that we've been waiting for for so long. So sometimes I just get get lost in the moment and I'm just like, wow. <laughs> but anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'd really appreciate it if you leave a like on the video and subscribe to my channel. I also stream over on Twitch and you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And if you want to support my channel even more, you can check out the links in the description down below. That is all for me for now. So bye and take care.